Fire signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out how does your person on your mind feel about you right now. And for those of you who like to book a personal reading with me, information is in the description box below. And today is the 22nd of January, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 8.33 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for fire signs. And if you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same fire sign. All right, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for fire signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Their person on their mind, how do they feel about fire signs right now? King of Cups in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so it does feel like... Uh, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you two, okay? Four of Cups, there's something that they're dissatisfied about. And the temperance here makes me feel like right now they need some peace. They need um, to be left alone. There's an energy of like, I just want to be left alone. Or that they could be feeling like you want to be left alone. So they're being very patient and, you know, giving you time here go vice versa and the seven of cups here in my first the magician in my first and the six of pentacles in my first they feel like maybe this is this is unequal something that is not equal is and they would like to make it equal because the temperance indicates balance and the six of pentacles in my first it's not balanced right now this moment but they want to balance it equal it like either Either one person is more invested than the... You could be more invested than them or they could be invested more than you do. Again, it could go vice versa. The four in reverse, they feel like maybe they've done something foolish for some of them. Unless they feel like you've done something foolish and that you should be the one reaching out to them and apologize to them. Or offer, offer them um, something. Uh, either an apology or commitment. Um, hmm. Unless they feel it will be a mistake for them to reach out to you and offer you something because you might reject them for cups. Hmm. If they already offered you something and you rejected them, then they definitely feel rejected by it. They feel like a decision has been made that they're not happy about. Either it's their own decision or your decision. The magician reverse, they feel like they can't quite manifest what they want to manifest out of this connection. Or that they're not actively pursuing you or, uh, or actively... Or actively... Or giving you what you want. Because it feels like the page is young. So I feel like maybe whatever they've got to offer to you, you you're going to reject it because... You may not want it. It may not be good enough for you. Or that they feel like they're not good enough for you. It could be that as well. They feel kind of helpless, like they don't know what to do. So right now, this moment with the temperance, they, they're just trying to be patient. Or that they feel like you need to be patient with them. Ten of Pentacles in reverse, and we've got the world here in reverse. They feel kind of stuck. They want to wait. That's what I'm getting. Or that they feel like you're making them wait. Um, Ten of Pentacles in my words can indicate maybe the future hasn't become a reality yet or I mean of course the future is a future but something about making the future into a reality but when it's in reverse it can indicate a delay or that they're not sure if that's going to happen so they feel kind of stuck with the world here in my first. If you're not with this person right now, if you're separated from this person, they feel like they would like to make peace with you for sure with the Page of Pentacles and the um, Temperance to restore harmony between the two of you. They feel a little bit overwhelmed. King of Cups here in my verse. They feel like you... Again, it could go vice versa, but... They're not sure... For some reason, they feel rejected by you. 
because they're not sure how you truly feel about them the king of cups and love first but they're also afraid to express to you how they feel about you in case you're gonna reject them for cups Unless this rejection has already happened. The lovers in reverse, seven of swords in reverse, and three of wands in reverse. They feel like a choice has already been made, right? In the past that, again, I feel that they're not sure if they made a mistake or not. And this is your energy, queen of wands in reverse, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. They feel like you're not interested in them, although, although they would like to know if you're interested in them or because it feels like when you are in reverse doesn't matter he or she is not gender specific but then it could go vice versa they feel like you're not really interested or not really that invested or not really that attracted to them or but they feel like you are two of cups like you are their best friend they feel you maybe have turned your back on them If, if this is a romantic situation, if somebody cheated on somebody, because some of the cards here can indicate that. If you're the one who has cheated on your person, they feel, they feel like you need to reach out to them and apologize to them. And promise them something here with the temperance. Promise to be good. It's an angel. If they're the one who has cheated on you, they feel like they need to. It just feels like they want to reach out to you, or offer you commitment, but they feel like you're going to reject them because, again, they're appearing as a page, so it's small. So it may not good enough, may not be good enough for you. If they're the one who has cheated, then they may feel like you're the good one, the, the angel, while the other one who has to admit their mistakes here with a fool by offering you something, Page of Pentacles. I feel like they need to talk to you about the future. They are kind of stuck, they are unsure if there is going to be a future between two of you and we've got Ten of Cups. Yeah, that would be what they want happily ever after with you. Or to reconcile if both of you are separated. If not, it, it, it does look like your person could be thinking about the future with you but it's it's all like an imagination ten of cups like a fantasy because the ten of pentacles here is in my first so they don't know if it can ever become a reality mm -hmm. pull a few of these cards here More. I am becoming a better person. I wish I could share my good news with you. I knew exactly what I was doing. I love you unconditionally. I am not available. I want to tell you how I feel. Yeah, I feel like this person really wants to tell you how they feel. I'm not available can be the king of cups here in my verse. Maybe they feel really overwhelmed emotionally right now. But they do have feelings for you. When the king of cups is in my verse, it doesn't mean that they don't, there's no feelings. Either it could be just too much for them to handle, or it could sometimes indicate someone who is not emotionally available. But in this, in this case, fire signs, they could be feeling like they're not sure if they could if they want to invest emotionally completely because it feels like this king is very vulnerable doesn't matter again he or she is not gender specific i knew exactly what i was doing i wish i could share my good news with you they may have sabotaged this connection in some way shape or form maybe this is the good news page of pentacles they could be feeling like they want to share it with you, but then you're not going to, you know, you're not going to be happy for them or that you're just not going to reply to their messages and just ignore them. Hmm. They feel like you are their best friend though, two of cups. Like both of you are supposed to be with each other. 
the ten of cups but it's all their cups so and these pentacles here in reverse so that means it's not a reality yet or that they're just imagining it and hoping for it all right fire signs your aries sagittarius is your reading hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe if you'd like to watch more of my videos um the, the other ones that I've already posted, I post them every single day, even twice a day, and I upload them right away so they're really fresh with different topics, different questions. There could be some other videos, uh, other messages that would be um, important for you. So check it out if you want to. And I don't want it to go to waste because I post them at odd different timing and you may have missed it. So a lot of readings over there and yeah, check it out if you want to. It's uh, on the daily readings playlist. It's on the screen right now. And then I'm going to leave you with another playlist. This is from the second channel. My second channel is a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And also just a reminder that I'm open for personal readings. I've added a few more options. I mean, a few options. Before that, there was no option. There was just one option. But so many people have requested to, you know, um, from requested for more options uh, in terms of the per uh, to book a personal reading from uh, from me so so i've added them for your convenience i can just send me an email if you are interested if you'd like to know um if you have any other questions okay before booking take care of our science hope to see you, see you back here again later or tomorrow bye